Hey guys, Mass here with another Minecraft video, and today I have something really special for you guys. I call it the 3x3 three three display paint board. So you're thinking, this is a joke. There's no freaking redstone under here. Weird. But you're probably wondering, why do I have this glass platform? That is actually a cursor. The cursor follows you around. Just as you see, it's just a cursor. And it'll stay where you are. Depends what square you're on. So that's that. But you're probably thinking, huh, that's kind of stupid, dude. Um, why would you just want something that follows you around? Exactly. That's why I added paint mode. If you look over there, you'll see paint mode. Paint mode is, uh, right here we're in cursor mode. Paint mode, you'll see in a second. Once we turn it on. Once we click paint mode, we click paint mode, it switches over to paint mode. Now, when we step on the the pad, it'll, uh, when we step on the drawing pad, it'll actually save what we draw. I guess we'll do a really demented L. <laughs> Say we think that's freaking stupid as crap. This is what the clear button is for. You gotta step out the board for a minute so it doesn't paint while you're on it. And, yeah! So we can just draw our new image. Say we really like this. You can you you can just press this also comes with a save functionality so you can just press the save button. It'll put it right into into the slot saver. Well, yeah. This is just a cursor. So you don't have to worry about your paintings getting ruined. And say we're really bored, so we really want our painting to come up. We press clear or not not clear. Save and then our painting can come up and then we can draw on it with ease. So I'm betting a lot of you are wondering how this works, and let's have a look-see, shall we? So, if you guys saw that, that was all the redstone behind it. And I'm betting a lot of you would like an in-depth description of it. So, if we fly back here, we'll see all these command blocks. Each command block has their own test for command that tests if the player is standing on a certain block. This will emit a redstone signal through these comparators. And these, this, um... This r rapid uh, pulse clock thing with comparator comparators it just re um, it just activates and deactivates these commands so it just keeps searching keeps searching for a player on that block so basically all the each each um set of pixels has their own and I will just show you how these wireless buttons work so basically if we look down here we'll see that each one has a command block I didn't well. Yeah, and if we come over here, we'll see that this one also has a command block. And are both set to scorger, scoreboard, objectives, add, reset, save, dummy. This is reset, save, one. And dummy is, I don't really know it. I'll put the YouTube video I found this in, found um, the wireless redstone trick, in the description below. So if you want to check his channel out, he's really cool. <laughs> anyway, um, if we look right here... We'll see, reset save, that's just the save name. Reset save one, I was going to add more saves, but I thought it's not really necessary, honestly. I might add a v version two of this, but virgin, Ver version, version, okay. <laughs> Sorry, tongue twister. Objectives, remove, if we go over here, this is remove save one. This ran, 
it this checks if it is shut off or not. When it when it activates, like I'll show you right here. Show you right here. Activates, you can look down here. It says add a new objective, reset save one successfully, and then it checks to remove it. It removes reset save successfully and it emits a quick redstone pulse. The redstone pulse gets um out here to these reset thingies that just reset the memory cells. And if we click this one, this one has the command oh derp. Uh, this one has the command add save one. Save one is just a different one. They both have to have dummy. And when we press paint paint over there it'll come up. And how this works is basically the same and it just removes it very fast. Hooked up to a really quick T flip flop. This is a piston, blah blah blah. And that activates these pistons, allowing the save to enter through the pixels. So yeah guys, if you guys like this, I would love to see a like, comment, and subscribe. I love a new addition to my subscribers, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye. One more thing, guys. I just want to thank all my buddies, Kelsey Brokacek, and all my other buddies who really don't have a YouTube vi account right now. So <laughs> I just, I have, I'll put, I, I have their links in the description below if you would love to check out their channel. I would really appreciate if you would. And... Thanks guys. Um just wanted to tell you guys that and thank you for all my buddies and bye.